Pre-engineered buildings are the most common type of steel building used in the industry and widely used for commercial structures like large warehouse, factory set or office buildings. There are several advantages of a PEB structure over the conventional steel buildings such as high durability, lightweight, obviously more cost effective and not only that, it also provides a flexible solution and higher construction speed for which pre-engineered buildings are now more popular in the construction industry. I think you are already aware that using STAD, we can analyze and design any type of PEB structure following the Indian, American or other popular design code. But do you know how to generate the 3D model easily with all the specifications and assign design parameters using the geometry information? If you have already designed any steel warehouse using STAD, then probably you are aware how hard it is to manually calculate and assign tapered profile, member offset, or several design parameters like the effective length or deflection parameters? Do you know we can easily handle this challenge if we generate the model geometry properly or using few custom templates? Hi, I am Shurajit Ghosh and I am starting a new series on PB structure design. In this series, I will discuss about all the hidden tricks and new features of STAT which can help us to model any type of PB warehouse or factory set more efficiently. My plan is to cover all the aspects starting from modeling up to the member, connection and foundation design. I will start with the conventional analytical modeler of STAT, create a 3D warehouse structure from scratch with tapered profile as raptor and column. Then I will discuss about other modeling requirements like how to assign an offset or beta angle, how to calculate and assign loads on the structure including crane load, selection of analysis method, optimization and result interpretation. Next, I will generate the same model using physical modeler and cover how the advanced features of this module like the cross section position, panel loading or tapered profile assignment to the physical entity helps us to create the model more efficiently. And not only that, how we can reuse the physical member information to assign design parameters like LYLZ or DJ parameter that will be covered. Finally, I'll show you the easiest way of modeling using a custom tool which I have developed to generate an entire PEB warehouse. There are few inputs related to the basic model information like dimension in three directions, Berlin and bracing information, tapered raptor and column dimension. We can also auto assign beta angle or offset, optimize tapered sections and finally click on the generate tab to create the model. See, entire 3D model is generated within few seconds. All the offset values in local axis are auto assigned to the Perlins. Tapered profiles are correctly assigned. Same for the beta angles which eliminates the tedious manual calculation and assignment process. Not only that, primary and combination loads are auto-generated using this tool. This is not complete yet. I am still working on the auto-assignment of design parameters. Do you want to know more about this tool or about the manual process of analysis and design of any PEB structure? This series is suitable for both professional engineers as well as for the freshers. Join me in this series and I hope you will learn something new. See you in the first part of this series, modeling of a PEB warehouse using STAD analytical modeler.